So where is the Siberian tundra? As you can see from this map, the distribution of the polar bears in Siberia are decreasing. Because of global warming, the ice layer is getting thinner and thinner and will soon not be able to support the weight of the polar bear. We can help the polar bears by using less carbon dioxide made things or using less carbon dioxide like cars. And reasons that cause the global warming is because of the greenhouse effect caused by carbon dioxide trapping the heat inside Earth. In order to conserve the species of polar bears found in the areas of the tundra, it is necessary for us to support this environmental policy. The name of the environmental policy we will be supporting is called the U.S.-Russia Bilateral Agreement for Polar Bears of the Chukchi Sea Population. It is signed in October 2000. The amendment years include October 14, 2007. Countries involved include the United States and Russia. The treaty is international. Environmental issues you further include the Polar Bear Treaty of 1973. It is used to enhance the goals of the 1973 Agreement on the Conservation of Polar Bears, as well as to conserve the outermost region of Chukchotka and the state of Alaska. Sydney species live in an extreme environment. It's harder than Sydney species in places like the rainforest or the grass. The reason is because the climate of the tundra plays a major role, and the organisms living inside this endangered area need to stay in the cold and harsh climate. For example, the snow leopard have grown long hair and thick fur in order to protect themselves from the cold. But as global warming is rising up the temperatures, the cold has become more of a thing that will cause them to die than something to help them. As a result of um, global warming, it is caused by our over emission of CO2 into the earth. So we can help by reducing our excess of CO2 into the air and stop learning to create pollution, which will all cause global warming that will melt the ice of tundra, raise the heat of tundra, and cause these animals to die. What other things do we need to consider about this problem? We also need to consider that if it's possible to reach this goal of saving these animals in the tundra, which is an extreme environment for people who already are on the verge of danger themselves in the tundra. There are many villagers and rural people that live in the tundra that survive through by eating these animals that live in the tundra, such as the snow leopards. They will hunt them down as food to eat. <laughs> 